Hello. How's it going? I'm Sue77. We're back into Subnautica Below Zero. Picking up where left off. Um, I decided to actually head, head, head back home. Uh, I was in the... Um, where was it? Been there. Uh, Z13. I think is where I was last. Did I go see PK... Yeah, that was United Volcano. Yeah, I got that. Um, D13 is where I was last, and that was way the heck over there. And that's where we got up to the entrance of uh, Phi uh, Robotics. And we have um, some uh, new gear we can make. We can make the cold suit, as well as the gloves and the helmet for it. However, if we're going to make that, we need Fire Mesh and Snow Stalker fur. Which is gonna suck. <coughs> Don't have that. Um, so in the meantime, I'll go ahead and make the uh, reinforced dive suit. I think I have all that stuff for me already. Uh, synthetic fibers, um, a diamond, and what else? Two diamonds and two titanium. Okay. There we go. Hey, Rudy, how you doing? Alrighty. <coughs> there we go. More protection and uh, better survival in hot temperatures. Or extreme temperatures. Very nice. Ooh. Hmm. Could be interesting. <coughs> Scoop up cheaters currently charging up. Let's see here. Okay, so I think what I do is I can use a pangling over here. Maybe I can grab some snow stalker fur from that. I will need to grab this. Uh, day's going pretty good. Day's going pretty good so far. Had a minor scare with power. Power suddenly dropped on me. That was kind of spooky. Uh, but it wasn't too bad. Four. Okay. Um, but it's all good. It's all better now. So, NBD. I need two more fiber mesh. Hey, Pinnacarid. How's the kitty loaf been doing? She's been doing pretty good. She's uh, as happy as ever. Just being her little kitty self. So, it's all good. So let's get this pangling thing. Uh, battery, silicon rubber, wiring kit, titanium. Wiring kit. With me and Heather, uh, pretty good. 
Nothing unusual as far as I can tell. Uh, let's put these ion cubes in with, the, with their brothers. Okay. Two titanium. I need a titanium and a copper wire. So one, two, three. And a copper wire. Pangling remote. And pangling. Without spy penglings, scientists may have never discovered that penglings incubate their eggs in small cave burrows, often alongside thermal lily roots. Any brass moments? No, thank God. None of that. Uh, all right. I think we should have pretty much what we need uh, to start exploiting the ice spires now. So let's head back to it. Hop into Scooty Puff. Steve's. Huh? Ugh. I hate it. I hate that. I hate that feeling. We gotta sneeze. It won't come. That's okay. Hi, Lena. I'm laying down there by the computer, huh? Let's hop out and do some repairs on the. Uh, Where's the sea truck? I think we need some, some fixings. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, you're a little damaged. There we go. Okay. Let's see what I have. Four? Okay. Hmm. Where am I? What's up, Van? Yeah, I can't put him in the base, but uh, I'll put Pengu safe and sound right there. Just shove him into a locker. Okay, let's turn on uh, Z13. Being a space turtle badly. I started a new game where I was playing as um, the Commonwealth of Man. That's 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 rough. Although being a xenoph uh, militaristic xenophobe is actually really powerful. It's a good meta. You want fleet power. Hey Sag, how you doing?
Tip Lord or Pit God? Uh, Tip Lord should. Uh, obviously, Tip Lord should win. Um, Empire Sprawl at the moment. Oh, Empire Sprawl is, sucks. Every new colony I have, I always put an administrative complex as the first one, just so I can keep the Empire Sprawl to a minimum. But it just steals jobs away from everything else. It sucks. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm going to hop out here. a beacon in right here uh, so it'll be channel to five robotics they're staring at me where are the minkies yet yeah they stole my uh, my scanner once I got it back a pain in the butt. Squeeze on through. Now watch this. I'll show you what I did to get out of here. Disengage. Oh, did I did I grab the I grabbed it, didn't I? <laughs> I grabbed the beacon with the with the ship. Wait. That was the beacon for home. Oh my god. Welcome aboard, Captain. I accidentally picked up the beacon for home. Oh, we had to make something, didn't we? Shoot. Hydraulic fluid. I forgot about that. Damn it. I forgot about that. Okay, we'll uh we'll drop things off here. I'll zip on back home real quick. And go get the hydraulic fluid made. And it's the home beacon, yeah. God, it's so dumb. But I did bark, bookmark uh, Midas Greenhouse. That was pretty fun. Um, I went around and I basically just took, after after last night, I went around and I just took pictures of uh, different places. Um, so I can get the best thumbnails for the video or for the VOD. So. Got some good ones. 
And those will be going up soon. I think the first one goes up uh, 14th, I think. Yeah. Just, I don't really make a whole lot of money for the thumbnails, so it doesn't really justify hiring out to get someone else in thumbnails. But um, I've been having fun with doing what I've been doing, which is uh, I have like a, a, a streaming thumbnail template that I apply. It's working pretty nicely, though. It's, it's pretty nice. All right, where's home? It should be over here. <clears throat> Is that it? No. Ah, it's over here. I can tell because the zippy zaps. I say free labor? Uh, I guess it depends. Recharge. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay, so I need four gel sacks and what else for this thing? Creep find C cluster. find C cluster, okay. That's easy. Um pump down here for the cluster. And the gel sacks are outside. One, two, three, four. True, true. There we go. One hydraulic fluid. I think that's all I need. Although, maybe I should get a second one just in case. Yeah. Unfortunately, I killed the one gel sack, so... Oops. Oh, and I, if I release uh, this guy into the wild, he'll grow to full size, but it'll also be passive towards me. Um, but he might attack my ships. Um, but at least he'll be passive, he won't attack me. Take a nap. I know. I'm as papa slash mama because I'm a female character. There we go. Let's grow that. Make a second hydraulic fluid, because you never know when you're gonna need more. There, that another bridge that needs to be uh, another bridge that needs to be uh, lubed up. Um, all right. I don't have what it needs to take to make a snow fox, because I don't know what the recipe requires, which sucks. But, I can whip together a drill arm real quick. 
There's lithium. I have three lithium. Is that enough? Yes. I need one. And, oh, titanium. That's right. WD-40 and duct tape. Uh, WD-40 and duct tape. If it's stuck and it shouldn't be, apply WD-40. If it's not stuck and it should be, apply duct tape. That's how it goes, right? This is how I learned it. Here we go. Piece of copper wire I didn't pick up. Always nice. That yeah, should be good. Uh, did I use the home beacon? No, not yet. Okay, though. Home was right here. There we go. Just pop that right there. Home. Welcome aboard, Captain. Modules are green. I've been to all these. What is that? Oh. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Here we go. Drill arm. <laughs> okay, you got everything. Mm. Let's head back in and get back to the frost zone. Beacon for home is set. Perfect. And the beacon for the channel to robotics is right over there. It's perfect. signature of some I am not sure what it is for go ahead and show sure what it is for go ahead and share it can't hurt 
Signal location uploaded to PDA. Hmm. Oh, yeah, uh, science fact. Um, sorry, I have to dig one up. Um, let me think here. Yeah, let me get one here for you. There we go. Ocean science facts. All right, here we go. Uh, did you know that uh, below 10 meters underwater, uh, you cannot see the color red or color yellow? Uh, divers will, anything that's red looks green in comparison uh, because of how the light is shifted by the, uh, the density of the water. Uh, divers can't see red or, or can't see uh, red or yellow. Uh, machines can still see the colors, though they're fine. Uh, cameras can still pick it up because they're not a, they're not affected. What are you going to pick up? I picked up. Um, I placed down Channel of Vi Robotics, and I had I placed down the one for home. Smart, I wish. <clears throat> All right, let's hop in and let's get into our prawn. Let's first put down some stuff. <coughs> There we go. You're right-handed. Welcome aboard, Captain. There we go. There we go. Sploosh. Alright, so now if anything wants to tussle with me, I have a drill. If and you want to tussle, I can fight back. Let's go repair this bridge. Yes. Bridge extended. <coughs> what do we got? To the northeast. It would be worth investigating. It would be worth investigating. But be careful. Of what? I recall ravenous creatures tunneling beneath the ice. Ooh, I can hear it. You can kind of hear it.
food bar. Another water ration. Fine last thump birds are pretty useful. Under birds are pretty bad. Dull time to give it a score of mineral nurse notes. Fresh ice word and sun is not going some pretty pop of stuff. Oh. Thumper. New hey. Synthesized. A diamond deposit. Drill it up. Take a look here. Okay, let's actually head it back. We should check this out place out next, but I think we need to check this place out once we have uh, the snow gear and also the snow fox. Cause then we can zip around the snow fox and we'll be fine. Dangerous weather approaching. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Not that they can cross the bridge, right? Let's, uh... Chug a look. Have a munch.
Fire Robotics is over here. Apparently there's a spot nearby Fire Robotics that has the, uh... A spot I can do with the Spy Penguin. Silver ore. Pathfinder tool. <coughs> Marbled anemone. Anemone. It's all silver. Circle. Win a circle, that's fine. Man, I can't wait. Only two days until this, this game is fully released. Hmm. Be fun. They're gonna change anything serious with it or not. Tight spaces, little pockets of fighting resources, can't carry much but local fauna. Okay, so let's do this. We're gonna deploy the pangling. Welcome aboard, Captain. And then Oh, and it's chill nice to hear. So another spot was it's one there, then I go down this way. So there's a good spot over here. Silver and copper. <gasps> Magicite! 
Hell yeah! Magnetite ore found. It's perfect. Okay, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna hop out. I'm gonna drop equip the ping the penguin. Got it. I got the snow sucker fur. <laughs> Super penguin buddy, you're the best. Anything else super interesting out here? Bad. I punched to death. Take a look. Um, equip my two hicker. Silver and copper. He attacked me. I had to defend myself. Well, I found the thing. Nope.
It's a nursery. Oh my gosh. That's so cute. Yeah, Luna. Get some more titanium on as well. Ah. Uh -huh. So much flares. Uh, sunset. Protocol uh, focus the flares. Not to the headlight of the snow, snow fox, start to flare with the dash. Just think of flickering out, hurt snow stalkers growl. Find this later. Now, I had a snow fox, I couldn't see, sun had set, he didn't run towards me. One last flare, I can see a snow stalkers in the light. They're scared of me. Definitely should dedicate resources for creating more. Huh. Flare's good. Leave me alone! Okay, let's pass through these caves so we can get back to the to the uh, to the prawn. Up we go. Welcome Hello, Prawn. Okay. I wonder if there's another snow fox fragment at the, uh, at five robotics. But I don't think I actually reached the area. I got around. So I think it's over here. There's five's back there. Stalkers here. I think we're getting close to where we saw, this is the, the bridge it looks like, or the, whatever it was.
maybe a crash snow stalker a, a snow fox wreck Other lab in a hot zone. Fiber mesh. Mesh, first aid kit. Okay. That looks interesting. There's like berries on the trees. I wonder if I can get through here. Yeah. Yeah. Frost Acacia. Uh, blue trunk tree, harsh climates, uh, infrequently limited glacier, fast growing root system that turns out rocky material trapped in the ice. Uh, huh. Alright. Makes sense. Water tablets. Hmm. Oh yeah, I saw the double mist. Yeah, that would be a neat feature. I don't think they're going to do anything like that though, because that could be kind of overpowered uh, but it'd be neat okay in I go oh If you're not cheating, then you won't mind if I record this conversation. Is that right? I have nothing to hide. Then what were you whispering about with Vin? Nothing. Th that guy is so lawful good, it's annoying. Wait, so you were trying to cheat. But no cheating occurred. So what does it matter? It matters to team morale. If you can cheat in the game, how can they trust you out there? I'm sorry, did you feel left out? Perhaps you would like to make a deal. Ugh, Parvin, no. You're shameless. You really never give up, do you? I don't. That's true. <laughs> Have a manual put that in my next eval. Very persistent. Huh. Oh. Hmm. New blueprint synthesized. 
My dearest Adeline at Rosita. Ugh, not dearest. Who says that anymore? Adeline, Rosita. Everything on the mission is going very well. Do you see now? Your doubts were unfounded. I am loved here, and... Oh, no. Rosita will say, Papa, why do you have to brag all the time? Papa, it's embarrassing. I want to apologize. Okay, no, that's taking things too far. I know we didn't leave things on the best note, but I want you to say the things I say sometimes. They just come out. I was going to send you what I say sometimes. They just come out. I was going to send you a message saying how great everything is here and how everyone loves me. I've had a promotion to a very important security dossier. I'm treated like a hero. But really, this is a cold, wet planet. The scientists are full of themselves. There's no action to speak of. The only thing I look forward to is weekly games of Alien Intruder, but more than that, of coming home to you. I am sorry for all the times I did not appreciate you, of our family, or the good life we had. And I... Oh, who am I kidding? I can't send this. What's the use? Oh, Parvin, that was a great message. Come on. What happened here? I sense many things here. Death among them. Oh, we found it. It's a big critter. the size of that leviathan. There's a lot of good materials here too. Some room for a brain must be bone and fat. New Walking around thousands of years ago when it fell through the walking around walking around thousands of years ago when it fell through the ice, it was infected with the Kara bacterium, of course the disease would wipe out the architects and most life on the planet. Unclear whether the mutated Kara pustules present an are responsible for the ultimate demise of the creature, and then Kira was released on four five four six B. Chairs were all but eliminated. Resistance. These were the only life source. Omega facility. Injectable container. <clears throat> Flesh and pustules. Saprophytic properties. Visible component to the network feeding out the dead cells.
damn. Hey, Sadie, doing well, how are you? Find something, we find something. My investigation of the fire excavation site, including the cave entrance and surrounding area, revealed minor cosmetic damage to Altera survey equipment and significant structural damage to the natural cave entrance and supports. Resulting debris prevents cave access without heavy excavation equipment. Only foot access is currently possible. We are reporting two casualties, Pavan Ivanov and Samantha Ayu. Both bodies were found beneath the rubble at the cave entrance Ivanov had just entered the cave. Footprints were still visible by the entrance. Deeper into the cave, Ayu appeared to have sustained a fall. Poor souls. What was Ayu doing? Nothing in her file suggests a history of vandalism or carelessness. And yet, I can only conclude that the cause of the collapse was employee negligence. We will need to investigate a possible connection to the explosive damage reported at Omega Lab. If there is a connection, who is responsible? This was Sam's necklace. She never took it off. It appears that your sister's death was accompanied by significant destruction. Doesn't make any sense. She would never destroy a base. Well, baselessly. Are your feelings confused? I am detecting more than one. I, I don't know. I, I feel disillusioned, worried. I thought I knew Sam. I was always the one breaking and rebuilding things. She was the one breaking and rebuilding things. She wouldn't even go into a bake sale without a plan. For classic oatmeal cookies, no less. So serious. She wouldn't have anything to do with my molecularly transformed caramel pretzel lumps. Your mind goes easily to food. To distract you from your feelings. Okay, I think that's enough mind reading for now. This wasn't negligence. That's not Sam. This was something else. Hmm. Patrol log, excavation site, day 33, morning. I thought I saw something moving on the screen, but it was just that I sneezed. Wiped it off. Fred's not convinced the Leviathan is really dead, but I've never even seen it blink. Nevertheless, I am now undertaking the mandatory foot patrol. Inside the cave, confirming a whole lot of nothing. Creatures still dead, cave still boring. I miss the mining site. At least you could talk to people. Oh, wait now. What's this? A rock. I found an interesting rock. That makes three this week. The others will be happy to have a friend. Concluding patrol. Perimeter secured. Nothing to report. End log. Okay, this will be, um, Leviathan Cave. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right, so. Leviathan Cave is here. What's all down here? Ooh. I guess we better head back. 
there's an artifact to look for, and then also I think we need to facility to find where uh, Omega is. There's Snowstalker pups in there. It's adorable. Emmanuel? Manu? Yeah, I agree. Seems very likely. Wait, is that a fragment? It is. Haha. -ha. New technology acquired. Snow Fox fragment. Magnetite, battery, lubricant, titanium. Awesome. Landing pad just north. The snow boss is actually kind of useful for all what it is. It's very quick. So, it's not too bad. And for the hydrate. We are back at Fire Robotics. Uh, not yet, however, I have heard them. Uh, I've unlocked the bridge so I can walk across to the other side, to the north. And that's where the, uh, the ice worms are. I've heard in the distance. See, here's the bridge. Alright. I 
got stuff. So let's get our... Stalker for a cold suit. Made of tightly knit Kevlar microfiber and insulated with an alpine yoke around the neck and shoulders, the cold suit is just. I'm in a cold suit. So now I should be uh, plenty fine protection from the weather. Now, to make this snow fox. Sam's necklace. A thumper. It thumps things. Handy. Uh, but I think what I need to do is I need to go... There was a lubricant back at the at the Leviathan site, but I don't want to wipe all the way over there. I want to check out this other place, this artifact over here. Maybe I could find Omega. Yeah, because this is fiberbotics. So if we go to the lily pad, I should be able to find Omega. That's down deep though, isn't it? Squeezing out. Piece of Allen. That's copper. So we should be like this direction right here. Yeah, I'm not ready for the S-Rooms yet. Once I, get, once I build a snow fox, is it a playable unit? Um, and a charging base for it? Then I'll go. We're going to go ahead with this artifact first. Mark it off the list. There's a lot of eye jellies out here. <laughs> they even hurt the ship.
Hmm. I'm guessing this artifact is probably in the deep vents. Yeah, box jellyfish. No joke. Even the Irukandji is something you don't want to mess with. And they're tiny. You'll be hard pressed to see an Irukandji before you bump into it on accident. The world has now turned purple. There's the vent garden. Another site found, but I cannot yet tell whether the others survived. Still, it holds valuable information. I hope you will find more. The network is indicating more of my people's technology, but the images I am receiving are fragmented, repeating. I am struggling to locate them precisely. Fragmented images? Why would that happen? I can only theorize that the locations are deep and shielded by a refractive material. Perhaps amongst large crystal formations. Crystal formations? Searches have been useful, but ultimately I have no definitive evidence as to the fate of my people. The network I hoped to rejoin may no longer exist. I cannot feel it. There could be a million reasons for that. Like, what if the network had a system update? They're on version 2001.4 and you're still on version 14.2. That would make me incompatible. How would I even begin to plan my upgrades? Okay. That's not what I meant. Bad example. You still know how to get home? Yes. So don't give up. Go there, see for yourself what happened. You are expressing optimism, but it is not supported by probability. Hope isn't based on statistics. It's born from a drive for something better. There's a poem Sam wrote. Hope is human. Hope is... Uh, oh, oh, right. Hope is the the thing with feathers this does not match any fauna designation i can find in your pda it's a line from a 19th century earth author emily something hope is the thing with feathers that perches in the soul and sings the tune without the words and never stops at all 
I promise we'll get answers one way or another, Alan. Adding hope to your database. Okay. I think we need to go to the big floating rock zone. Hope. Hope. Find and maintain hope. Aw, oh, Alan. Oh, you're a mensch. In the big floating rock zone, I should be able to find. Well, up yours, Jules, right? I should be able to find Omega. the crash ship Uh, I have yet to see a warper. Uh, I do not. I've never seen a warper in this game. Uh, unless I need to go either. This direction and down, or this direction and down? This direction and down I go.
through here to the right and down. Wait, this just leads to the... The reflection spot. That's not where I need to go. No, this ain't right. Where, where do I go to get in? Hold on, I need to get some fish. New creature discovered. New test subject, please report to test lab Alpha One. New test subject. Hey Red Knight, thank you for becoming a uh, two one sub with Prime. There we go. Vital signs stabilizing. Nothing. Okay, let's head back up then, I guess. This way. Find some bladder fish, that'd be perfect.
New follower, please report to meeting room Gamma 5 for orientation. Hey, thank you for the follow, Pills Q. Harbor's flying closer from this. Creature discovered. Newt fish. Just newt, newt. No, they won't do that. Back. Thank you. All right, let's go. Just gonna go up. And southeast, I think. Look, a bladderfish. Let's get some water. Oh. Uh, no, you can have a lot of them, uh, but the more you have, the slower you go. There we go. I feel like if I go to friends. Yeah, this is like edge of the map territory.
Okay. Let's get our bearings. So, Fire Robotics is over there. Delta Island is over here. And according to this map, it should be right about here. This, I think, is Mida's. I think Mida's place is here. So if I look to the east, it's north. So I'm over here. I need to go this direction. There's a glow whale. This is the big floating rock. I'm gonna, look it, I'm gonna look it up. Let's take a look here. Uh, Omega Lab. Lily Pad Islands, 200 meters. Inside one of the large, inside one of the large, Blueprint synthesized. Neat. Take that home. Swim charge fins. New blueprint synthesized. A bulkhead. You're right. 
uh, Omega Lab. New blueprint synthesized. Heavy impact, perhaps from a sea track modified with some sort of battering implement impact. Perhaps from a sea track modified with some sort of battering implement. A localized explosive charge was then released and detonated from a distance. Lab equipment was damaged to the point of inoperability, and all live specimens were destroyed. No personnel was injured. Samples have been collected for analysis to determine whether any bacteria escaped. It is, however, unlikely. The heat of the charge should have boiled everything within a 10 meter radius. Hmm. All right. The task revolution. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Vending machine. Synthesized. I challenged your spy pengling to a foot race earlier. Because you got tired of losing to me? Ouch. <laughs> what if I've been letting you win so I could see you smile? Cute. But I don't believe it. There are easier ways to make someone smile. Easier than losing a foot race. Oh, I think you're a woman with many talents. What are you implying? The artwork that appeared in my lab the other day. Oh, that. A study in Parhelion Red. I assume you had something to do with that. That depends. Do you like it? It's be if I didn't know better, I'd say you were flirting with me. If I didn't know better, I'd say you were flirting with me. Do you know better? I don't know what I know anymore. Not when you're looking at me like that. Uh, uh, Danny's not here, I'm afraid. Uh, that's okay. It's you I wanted to see. What's that you're working on? Just a sketch for a piece I want to make. <sighs> I'm slacking off. Don't tell the boss lady. <laughs> I won't. It's beautiful. What is it? I'm doing a series inspired by bacteria. Mutant beauty. Life, death risk. You know, that kind of thing. What's this one? It looks like Karab, but Vin, is this a mutation? It's just an art project. You know you're doing that thing with your neck, like when you're trying to bluff an alien intruder. <sighs> All right, fine. Fine. I'm bad at lying. Are you mutating Karab bacterium from the frozen Leviathan here in this lab? Please don't ask me any more questions. I don't think I need to. Mm. Oh. All right, let's go park over here and then we'll see what is in the big room. Oof. This place got charred. We've studied the first Kara bacteria samples from the specimen. Paired multiplication of cells in a controlled environment, resulting in the creation location of cells in a controlled environment, resulting in the creation of several different mutations with potentially useful applications. Think of the possibilities life-saving treatments, genetic research. It could be a window to understand the evolution of life on this planet. The findings could move us forward by years. We recommend a wider study, using samples collected from a greater variety of sites around the original pustules. We trust you will provide the necessary security to do so. The Leviathan site must be protected. Okay, well... Now we know. There were, f 
they were fucking around. Let's get out of here. Let's head on back home. Saw this then. Spot that has Allen parts. Uh, I've already got one of them. A skeleton. Is beyond the Omega base. Like, beyond where? Well, no matter. I'm gonna head home, anyways. It's uh, getting, t getting to be that time. Cave tunnels. Yeah, I think there was a part down there that was a skeleton that was. And that's where I got the skeletal parts. So, and that's where I got the skeletal parts. So, that was way down below in that, uh, the reflection cavern that it went to. And I was a little confused as to why I was back there again. So, I think I'm good. I think there's an entrance to the deeper areas in at Marguerite's base, if I remember correctly. So let's see. Might be worth a look. But either way. Coming home. Oh boy. Uh, 
home sweet home. God, ain't she a beaut? Look at that. Doop 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 do. Time to charge up the old Scooty Puff Jr. Welcome aboard, Captain. Fix that up. All patched. the Karah, for sure. Seek fluid and take. There we go. Hang in there, baby! The new Sea Truck X-12. Yeah. Drink and uh, wrap. Drink and uh, and uh, wrap it up. Vital signs stabilizing. Yuck. Perfect. Oh, I ate the, the fruit, didn't I? Oh well, that's fine. Uh, all right, put that all back. We got some more salt. We have plenty of stuff in the system I need to dump. But most of all, we have magnetite now, which is oh so good. So I can finally get that uh, that scanner chip and float around and help me scan things up. We could do a drone. It's pretty great. Range. That's good. We can really overhaul the scanner room and make that worth it. Um, but alright. Uh, so I'm going to wrap it up here now, for now. Thank you all for joining us. Uh, if you watched the VODs, thank you very much. Appreciate that. Uh, you can catch me live every Tuesday and third Wednesday. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday at 6 o'clock p.m. Pacific time. Uh, Wednesdays are usually spent sending with Sarah. She's not feeling too good right now, so none of that with her. Um, but that's okay. Uh, it's uh, twitch.tv slash tube77. And uh, thank you very much. And check you later. Bye bye. I want to give a special shout out to my patrons for their support, including Fire Tiger 1986, Speed Plays, Stealth Keo, Sir Taz 13, Death Boy, Ninja Punk Jess, Lil Beautiful, Chimney 97, Kevin R 1999, Craftstar, Rogue Deity, Psionics, IG Scar, and Tatiana, and everyone else who supports me, you all are amazing.